Let's we'll see what we've got up here then, shall we, folks? Oh, try and stag. Nice start. We've got one way and come back the other. Ford Model A. A? Oh, okay. There's an old Austin there. Look at that. The old car lovers there. Morris Minor. Doc Carton had one of them in EastEnders. A Mark One Escort. Very nice. Nice car. <laughs> There's a lot of Mark 1 Escorts today and Mark 3 Cortinas. Oh wow, look at this. This is absolutely stunning. Mexico in purple. Cadbury's purple, look at that. That's worth a screenshot of that, isn't it? Stunning car. As is this one here. Lovely car. Pardon? <laughs> Check your owner's club. Hello, folks, having a good time? Oh, yes, fine. Yeah, good. Hello there. Hello. Yeah, YouTube. Oh, lovely. Life on the ocean wave. Wonderful. Yeah, give us a look. Yeah. <laughs> Your car will be on there. <laughs> no? Yeah, it's beautiful, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah, fantastic. Oh, yeah. I'm in my element today. <laughs> I left the wife at home. She doesn't want that. <laughs> See you later. Thank you. Jaguar, more modern, less modern. Well, oh, that's very nice. Very nice car, sir. 1968. 1968. Well, Mark II. I thought it was a Mark. I don't, no, not up to be. Um, not up to in Jaguars, but. Uh, oh, okay. Yeah. 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 Reminds me of the Sweeney. Yeah, very, very similar. Yeah. Actually not quite the same. No, no. Very, very they used the Mark 1, didn't they? Yeah, I think it was, yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah. But very nice indeed, anyway. Lots of Jack was here. That's nice. Very nice. People got their cars on trailers. I don't blame them really. Yeah, I mean, I would absolutely love to be able to afford to have a classic car. Yeah, well, I did. I used to have Capris, I used to go to shows, but I can't afford to do that no more. Poor Mark One had to go because he was a bit rusty. He went to Ireland in the end. Yeah. Have a Triumph Stag. Yeah, there's nothing better on a hot summer's day like this. Just to take your car, show it, and be able to just sit and chill out. Go around the clock tower, mate. Yeah. There's some more coming in. All right, yeah. All right, yeah. 
RS. That's a strange looking vehicle, isn't it? Is that hand painted? Wow, weird. I just the paint works. Sorry, I don't like. I don't like touching. Rubber paint. You can touch it. Yeah. Yeah. You look, if you sit here all day, you won't believe the number of people who have to have to touch. Wow. So, yeah, it's a rubber paint. That is very. I'll have to take a photo of that. That is very unusual. The only one on the planet. <laughs> wow, that is. That's pretty amazing. Thanks for talking to me. Thanks. Thank you. Well, that uh, X5 was, uh, as the guy said, was rubber paint. Uh, very unusual. Now, we have got here XR3i in red. I used to own one of these back in the day. The boy racers liked them, didn't they? Not as I, but I was a boy racer. <laughs> yeah. Moving on. <laughs> Yeah, I uh, also owned one of these, Sierra, I had uh, two or three Sierras. They were nice cars. You don't see many a day though. Haven't said that, you come here and see three or four. A Volvo. I didn't see any. Cosworth could well be folks no it's a XR4 still nice not as good as a Cosworth but still nice RS2000 Mark II Escort very nice example Oh wow, 2.8 injection, <laughs> stunning, I had one in blue, can't be all get on board. Two point eight injection, these are worth thousands and thousands now, 10,000, 20,000 upwards, one in showroom condition, absolutely amazing. comes another Capri folks, a lot of Capris here today. That's the Brooklands. Very nice. I'll go and check that one out later on, go and find that, that Brooklands Capri. I've done full circle of the cars, now I'm going to find some more. We're going to the middle now where Italian gardens are. Well, we're in Italian gardens now, so there's more cars on display here. It's a nice Ford Anglia, that. A prime example. Very nice. Horace Traveller. Very nice, that. Lovely, look at MG there, look at that, wow. That's a beautiful car. Roadster. Spotless. Absolutely spotless, that one.
Yeah, folks, we just uh, I'll just show you these fountains these, on the Italian gardens, they're absolutely beautiful. That's a good one, that is. That's a beauty, folks. MGB. Stunning. Wow. Beautiful. Thank you. Absolutely stunning. You must be, you must be very proud. The oh, yes, please. Wow. That is, wow, look at that. It's clean as a whistle, isn't it? Wow, look at that. Yeah, we're on the YouTube channel, so um, all this will be on YouTube tonight. Oh, great. Yeah. Good. Both on the ocean wave. Right. Yeah. Oh, that's a beaut. Thanks very much. Okay, you're welcome. Thank you. Oh. Caught my eye. That's not. <laughs> That's yours as well. Wow. That is. What? what Could I ask what? Yeah, what it is? What is it? Yeah, it's a 1967 Mini Moog. A Mini Moog. I've heard of them. Yeah. Yeah. yeah I've seen them. There's some uh, some uh, information on the bonnet. Oh, okay. Oh, that, that's pretty cool. I like that. Yeah, folks. That's a, a Mini Moog. I've been told. There's some information there. Oh, look at this. Yeah, GTI, Mark One. Look at that. Wow. Stully motor, sir. Thank you. Very nice. Mark one? Yes. Yeah. Lovely. That's what we saw in Livon. I'm sure this is something like that we saw in Livon. Like a Morgan of some sort. Fine example of a Mark II Escort. Let me go back older. A Singer. Yeah. What a lovely car this is. Look at that. Sure is a boot. That's a singer. The singer will be on in a minute. Austin 7 Cabaret. 
Very nice set one, folks. Let's go Mexico again in green. Very nice. OMGs. Loads of M loads of MGs here. Oh it's a few. There's a few motorcycles turned up. Let's go and have a look at these. Look at this. 1924 French Automoto. Sunbeam. Lovely bike. More a bit more modern as a BMW. Now we've got a classic Honda Command, Norton Commando Honda. Classic Commando there. Beautiful, isn't it? Lovely sunbeam. Got the BSAs here. A65 Lightning, 1965, wow. Triumph Trident. Very nice. A bit more modern, Suzuki. Classic. Classic Japanese. Triumph. Let's have a look up here, folks, see what we can find. There's an old bus, isn't it? Well, it's not a bus, you know what I mean? Get on this side first. That's nice, isn't it? Yeah. Vauxhall. Vauxhall VX. What an American styling on that one, I think. A few modern ones up here. <coughs> nice Jaguar. Time for Dolomite.
You humble? Go back on this side, folks. This is a nice old van, this one, look at this. An old Bedford, wow, look at that. That's pretty stunning. The Bedford 10 seat coach. Built at Willowbrook Coach Builders in Loughra. The other two are actually having the Queen Mother's Royal Household and kept at Buckingham Palace Mews. The transport household staff between Clarence House, Sandringham, and other royal residents. It has space in the back for the Queen Mother's corgis or luggage. The coach was used on the Queen's Jubilee tour on the coach of a Silver Jewelry in 1977. There you go. How about that then? And I've got some entertainment going on over there. Ah, uh, army vehicle, Land Rover. Very nice. Oh, I just love this. Oh, look at this police car, folks. Oh, that's stunning. And you've got a blue light in front of it. Right? Uh -huh. I'm going to actually arrest you. Yeah. Oh, sorry. It's alright. You seen? Right, so back to the start now. And they've got some music going on here, look. The George Formby Society. Thank you. 
these Willie Jeeps. Mm. Land Rovers. That's a fine collection, that, isn't it? It's almost these that live them last weekend. Oh, that's what I did for him for the 